Back now at 543. Now this Saturday, the Portlandia Mermaid Parade and Festival returns and celebrating our community connection to Portland's rivers and all the glitz and glam of those mermaids. Cor Harlan joins us live this morning in downtown Portland. He has transformed into a merman and has more on what <laughs> you can expect for this year's event. Good morning. <laughs> this is never not fun. In all the years we've been doing this, this is never not fun. Welcome to uh, Salmon Street Springs this morning. Una the head mermaid has arrived. She is uh, very much in form as is everybody here this morning. First of all, I just want to give everybody a big shout out for looking just fabulous this morning. You are not uh, mermaids out of water. You look very good all, everybody, everybody, everybody has gone all out this morning to put on the, uh, the mermaid. Una, how's it going? Great, how are you? I'm well, I am well. Tell me about this Saturday's parade. It's gonna be fun, huh? This is our seventh annual Portlandia Mermaid Parade and we are really excited to be coming back down to the waterfront. And uh, we have two special guests with us this morning. All right. These are our Mer ambassadors and we'll hopefully get a chat with them in a little bit. Uh -huh. Mermaid Chloe and Mermaid Luna. Now they had to apply for this, right? They had to apply. We yeah. had 11 applicants uh -huh. and uh, they all had to submit an, either an essay or a video to tell us why they felt that they were deserving of being the Mer ambassadors for 2023. The Mermaid Parade, I'm, I'm trying to ask everybody for the deeper meaning here. This sounds like it simply is what it is. It's just a lot of fun. Tell me what happens at, uh, I guess, 12.30 you have a little event, and then 2 o'clock the parade gets started down here at Tom McCall Waterfront Park, Yeah, right? so at 12.30 we gather at the Japanese Historical Plaza, and we do our annual sort of opening ritual with mm -hmm. shells and water, and we have a mer drag race this year in honor of our recently departed Queen Darcel herself, uh -huh. and we'll be honoring our junior mer ambassadors as well. And then when we're all done with that, with some song and dance, then we will launch the parade at 2 and we'll make our way down swishing our tails down the waterfront to Poets Beach where we'll have a beach party. Awesome. I can hear the uh, video rolling there from uh, maybe last year's uh, parade. Weather should be beautiful in the low 80s around midnight, so it's not too hot to be in the uh, in the uh, fence. Now, anybody can come down here too. You don't need a fin to be a part of the parade, correct? You don't need a fin. We do ask people to dress up though, but we don't want that to stop you from coming down. But this is a parade where rather than spectating, we want you to be a part of it. So come dressed up, I say, you know, upcycle, do costume cosplay, just pull something out, put some glitter on and come on <laughs> down and have a good time. Michael, run the, run the line here one more time, if you would, please, and just show everybody. There's the young mermaids there. There's uh, mermaids, there's mermen. Check out the merman with, I can't pass up that big red beard he's got on. Mermans have beard too. Amanda the mermaid on the end there, looking all the part, nice, nice tail. Everybody's got a nice tail out here this morning. And my friend here to my left, what's your name again? Finsu. Finsu, Finsu is his name. He's married to a very generous woman, I'll tell you that, as am I. I we all know each other. We recognize each other when we're married to uh, very generous women. Finn recognizes Finn. Finn recognizes <laughs> Finn. And I'm telling you right now, you're not going to get more. I, I don't like to bring up Donald Trump references during these segments, <laughs> but that's a lot of gold on you, and you're looking good. And the dog is here. This is uh, Una's husband as well. And I suspect your dog, right? Yes, dog that's Bailey. The He's the well. mer puppy. He's the mer puppy. All right. Mermen. Mermaids, the parade starts at 2 o'clock, as uh, Una just referenced, 12.30 at uh, the Japanese Historical, Historical Plaza. Plaza down at the north end. That's at the north end of the waterfront park there. So come on down and check it out. They'll be down here walking up, uh, walking up the park on their way to Poets Beach underneath the Markham Bridge for a little swim afterwards. A lot of fun. Just a good, this is a good, if there is a more uh, Portland event, I don't know what it is. Uh -huh. uh, because the Mermaid Parade is everything that Portland is kind of right. You are correct in that core. I, just, I love the the costumes. Everybody goes all out. These these oh, mermaid great. outfits Even so Core good. goes all out. I you do think Core got thanks to the help of some True. other. Mer yes, people. yeah. True, I do think Core got good. upstaged by the mer puppy that was uh, out there. I though. think <laughs> I know what Samwise needs to be for Halloween. Oh, this year. Yeah. there you go. The 